Hi guys, my name is Caitlin, and as you can probably tell from the title below, this is going to be an introduction video of myself and also the channel that you're currently watching. Now, most of you probably got here uh, by typing in eye disease or stargarts or macular degeneration or a plethora of other fun and exciting eye topics. I know. But I just want to say thank you, first of all, for clicking on the video and I hope that it opens up an avenue for you um, of a, a good support system that I am trying to build. And that is ultimately the goal of these videos. So my Stargardt story is not very exciting. Um, I don't remember a time when I didn't rely on my peripheral vision. I thought it was normal. I thought it was the way everybody viewed the world. Um, when I would try to explain it to my friends or family, I could never convey myself very well or very clearly um, and so I think they were always a little bit confused on what I was trying to say so I didn't really bring it up because I thought I was just blowing things out of proportion and that you know it was that it was normal I didn't realize that it was a really anything to be on the lookout for so it was about two years ago that I just went back to a regular optometrist to um, rate, to change the prescription in my glasses, hoping to solve some of my vision problems that I was having. And at that visit, um, that was the first time that he, I really, that he said macular degeneration and that I really paid attention to it. Um, because, you know, he started telling me all about the effects and the symptoms of it and, um, it pretty much fit what I was going through and so I finally realized oh <laughs> this isn't normal there is something bigger at play so after that I went and saw a few different eye specialists and it seems to be that the consensus is that they all pretty much feel that the type I have is called Stargardt's So I have to tell you this story because it makes me smile every time I think about it. Um, it was one of the first appointments um, within the last few years. Uh, I was actually visiting my parents back home and the eye doctor that I had been going to since I was pretty young, he heard what was going on and he, he wanted to see me. And so he opened up his office just for me. I think it was during the holidays. He was rushing out of town, but he wanted to see me. So he opened up his office just for me. It was very kind of him. And, um, but my dad was with me at this appointment. And so, uh, this, my eye doctor, he just wanted to see for himself, um, if he could try and pinpoint exactly what it was. And, um, and that was when we first heard the term Stargardt's. But my dad, he doesn't hear very well. And so his, he thought the doctor said star farts. And so I just see him snickering, you know, in my peripheral vision, my dad just snickering in the corner, like, dad, this is serious. Why are you laughing? I'm going through some serious eye trouble right now. And my dad's just in the corner laughing. And so he told me when we got home that he thought I had star farts. As you can tell, I'm in my car. I am still able to drive. I don't know how long that's going to last because um, I have seen serious changes in my vision the last um, especially the last year, um, I actually had to leave my job. Um, well, I didn't have to. They they were very kind and willing to work with me. And um, even just, they were willing to let me just sit at my desk and stare at the wall and get paid for it. Uh, they were absolutely amazing. But um, I did not want to do that, obviously, for for many reasons. So I made the choice to take a step back and leave steady good income and um, my amazing sister and brother-in-law have been so helpful and they're letting me stay with them until I can get back on my feet and um, they've just been amazing and so I like to come in my car because it's kind of the only place I can be alone anymore and so Thence, thence, hence why I am in my car right now shooting this. This year is just going to be 
a great year. I can feel it. I am just, I'm pumped up with the business that I'm starting, which I'll tell you about in the next video. Um, I just, I have great hope and I think it's going to be a great, can I say great a few more times? It's going to be a great, great, great year. You know, we all have our struggles. We all have our trials. No one is immune to them. We're all going through something. And, you know, even if it's not something with your eyes, I want you to be here so that we can support one another. That's the point of this channel. I just really want to foster an environment where we can support one another and uplift and inspire each other just because, you know, our lives are changing and they're going to continue to change because we're having to adjust to a whole different lifestyle. But it doesn't mean life is over. There is so much beauty and so many things to accomplish still. And so that's what I hope to do with this channel. I want to bring a smile to your face. I want to brighten your day. And I hope that it's a place where people feel comfortable and that we can share our trials with each other and just be a support group. That is the ultimate goal. And I hope that we are able to accomplish that. If you're interested in being a part of this group, um, please subscribe. Um, if you don't, totally fine. If you do, that's awesome. But believe me, this could very well be me just having a conversation with my steering wheel, which would not be the first time. So that is my story and I am definitely going to go into more detail later on if you guys want to know about it. If not, that's totally cool. I just want to thank you again for taking a few minutes out of your day to watch this video and I hope to see you guys on the next one. Bye.